Hey y'all, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can get, how you can make your videos have the best quality, 4K quality in CopCut PC. This is a tutorial, this is an updated version of my old video, my first video that I've created. So make sure you watch it until the very end because I'm gonna show you step by step. Okay, <laughs> make sure you watch till, till the very end. Don't miss any step because every step is very important to take in order to create, in order to gain, in order to make your video look the best. Okay, so make sure you follow along with me. And also, if this video is going to help you, make sure you subscribe. I'll really, really appreciate it. I'll really appreciate it. So, thank you so much. If you subscribe, I'll really appreciate you if you could subscribe. And now let's jump right into the video i know your time is important so let's start this tutorial so let's import this video i have a download the tutorial don't uh, video i i don't for you for this tutorial this is the video looks good i mean the quality is good i'm not saying the quality in this video is not bad i think it's very good look at it just look at it it's very good but we're gonna make it better i think it's gonna look way better so what you have to do Let's go to effects, and here in effects, why the my zoom in is not working. Apparently, it's not working. Cup cut. So, what you have to do? Oh, now it's working. Okay. So, what you have to do, guys? Click on effects, and here in effects, now this tab looks way different than the older version. Well, older cup cut versions looks way different. But I looked for you. I, I caverns. I, I looked. I tried to find the, again the results. Cause now they look way different. Have different names, and it's completely, it's completely different different categories and different icons you can see here and we have we have different icons than the older ones so what you have to do to click on first is comic so click on comic but now as you can see comic looks different as well uh, we have a comic here but that's not the one uh, that's not the one you want to use instead of using that you have to uh, just scroll a little bit up and here you should see this one this is the one we have to use so grab it or click on this plus add to truck is better it's more effective it's more productive extend this um, the end so we want for the entire video and then what you have to do is to go to now let's go to lens and here in lens we have blur now it's way different now it i think it was called basic and it looked the icons or the images weren't here or, or they had images obviously there were images but i'm saying it was a totally different image but anyhow just add to the track this one as well Puck, like this like that like this like that now we have this that means nothing but it will mean it has meaning this video it has meaning i mean this you know lines that look like don't mean anything but you know just uh, carry on just bear with me trust me okay just trust me let's do it now just we have to export this i already exported this and now what you have to do is to delete this sketch. So click on delete. You can also click on backspace. We we'll only need blur. And now go to effects, please. And here in effects, we have to we have to do something very important. So we have to go to where is it? To comic. Comic. And here, let's scroll a little bit down and here look for neon. Neon. Don't grab it and drag it onto the timeline because that takes more time. We want to be productive, okay? So just click add to the track, extend this. And now, just export this as well. Click on export, make sure it's 60 FPS. Why? Because we want 60 FPS. Here in the resolution, um, make sure it's 1080p. We don't want 4K as of right now. This is gonna, you know, we're gonna make it 4K, but not, not right now, okay? Not right now. And then after you export your video, make sure you click on import, and then you import your videos that you exported, click on open, and then grab these videos, put it here, and then 
just to select these two effects that we have here and click on delete and then grab this one actually this one i'm really sorry grab the other one put it over the other one just stack it over and then we have this okay just trust me we're gonna we're gonna make some magic here we're gonna you know okay i'll stop we're gonna do something okay <laughs> so what you can do here is let's see if i remembered actually i do remember just click on basic basic uh, and rata here right here video basic and then mode mode we have blend make sure it's select it's you enab enable blend and here you turn it on and then here in mode expand mode normal to and here make sure you select color burn for this video make sure it's for this video all right make sure it's for this video please and the second video select the, the other one that is stuck over the first one they're above each other the first one please select it and then go to blend normal and here select color dodge and this is what we have voila and now it looks i like it i like these colors i really like fantastic colors no they're not fantastic i'm more like um it's not all realistic colors let's put it that way like it's not realistic colors but i think it looks good for an edit that you put on tiktok you know that you put on your social media i think it looks good i don't i suppose that you don't want something that is like natural like this one i guess i'm not sure but if this looks too cartoony not cartoony what's the right word if this looks like too unnatural Maybe that's the right word. Just grab this and drag the way all. Not this one, but yeah, actually the other one. Drag this all the way down. Okay, now we don't have this. I mean, look, these these lines. I know you can see. I think you can see. Look, these lines here, the yellow lines, the high, the highlight lines. We don't have them here as you can see and now i think it looks better it looks more natural now if you want even more naturally grab grab um, not grab this but you can but we'll just destroy our edit you can just put this up to around here maybe depends on your video obviously for your videos will have different colors different uh, you know structure different per character and so on and so forth but now another thing that you can do and i showed you in another video as well i like that we can add a custom adjustment only for a part of the video grab it and here and here uh, grab this and now sure you can increase sharpen which you don't have to but i'm saying you can and here you can increase brightness but not too Depends now a lot of your video, but that, that, that's, this is just up to you. You don't have to use the same setting because it depends a lot on the video. Like, it's all about your video. But I think in this video, I just have to think to yourself, right guys? Just think to yourself, what I need in this video to add. Like, what doesn't look, what I need to highlight, what I need to, where I have to, you know, move the viewers attention to on which objective and i'm trying to move their attention to her face so i'm gonna highlight increase the highlight because i look it i think because i think it looks too pale i guess so yeah i just what i'm trying to do and that's my thought process if you ask me and that's about it guys that's what it is and I hope you like this video. I hope you learned something. I hope you learned something. Because if you didn't learn, if you didn't learn something, it just was just a waste of time. So I hope you learned something. Thank you for watching. And I hope you're gonna have a fantastic day. Make sure you subscribe. I really appreciate it. Actually, I really appreciate it. So thank you for watching and take care.